Hey guys, it's Jay Wong here. Today we're playing on Counter Strike. Nah, it's just Mind Strike. And this is a fun version of Counter Strike. It's just meant for Minecraft, though. And this map is actually a replica of the actual Counter Strike source map called Garage. So there's like almost nothing like different between them. Like it's almost like pixel for pixel, block for block. As you can see here, it's almost exactly the same. If you ever played Counter Strike um, Glow Offensive, or Offensive, or Counter Strike Source, I think that's in Source as well. Um, it's pretty much the same thing. Um, now the question is, does it play like Counter Strike? Now, as for the most part, it plays mostly like Counter Strike in terms of a Minecraft perspective. But of course, there's gonna be a load of differences in terms of gameplay or in terms of just items. For example, there's not as many items in this one compared to the actual one and of course there's some grenades missing like the decoy grenade now we're playing on the uh, terror side or it's known here as the El Jahasa and our goal is to plant the bomb at either A or if you fly over here um, B and the goal objective for the SWAT team is to prevent the terrorists from planting the bomb and if they do plant the bomb, they have to defuse it, or else the terrorists win. If you ever play Call of Duty, it's almost the same as um, Search and Destroy, but unlike Call of Duty, this game is no run and done. There's, you have to be really still when you play this game. Um, for the most part, you have to be playing in such a way that you have to um, have to be really precise with your shots. You can't waste ammo. If you waste ammo, you are probably gonna be in big old trouble. Um, let's start off with just getting off a lower price gun if I can afford it. Yes, I can. I'm gonna get the PP Bison. Now, I wouldn't always recommend the PP Bison, but um, in this case, I bought a bunch of grenades, so I have to buy something. Um, now, hopefully we win this round because we won the first round. And the first round is known as pistol round because you all, guess what, you all start with a pistol. Alright, got a one kill over here. Oh, be careful. I like the PB Bison because it has a lot of capacity and it is easy to kill, like what I just did on like the second round. Now, there's other guns you could obviously choose, like the P, P90, I think it is. Yeah, the P90. And that one has a lot of capacity and it kills pretty well. Now we had to find the person that uh, plant it has the bomb because if you don't, then they, they might come back, or we have to find it, everyone on the team and kill them. He has a scope gun? Oh, yikes. Was, oh, I got him with a headshot anyways. Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Okay, so it looks from the looks of it, they we planted a bee, so we should probably all head to bees and help our bud, because he's by himself. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Um, let's see. Is our bud here? Yeah, he's, he's here. Okay, I'm going to make sure no one... Is defusing the bomb because if they are, well, we're in big old trouble. So I'm going to stay here. Oh, someone threw a flash. Could be careful. Now, nah, someone's probably around the corner. Okay. They're definitely around the corner. I'm going to go around here. Oh, there you are. Hello! Oh man, he got me with the PP Bison. I got some decent damage on him. He should be dead. Yeah, he's dead. Ooh, and the bombs explode and he doesn't make it. There's. We will be running around though. 2 0 for us, and let's go from here. Um, oops. Now let's go here, buy some armor, and let's buy an AK 47. I love the AK. It's, it's, a, it's a really good gun in this game, and both in the real Counter Strike Source, in Global Offensive, and in this game as well, because I think if I'm correct, if you shoot in the head of this one, you can uh, get a one hit kill. Like if you shoot someone with. Yeah, let's go here. Or not. Maybe not. I'm not too sure. I probably missed a headshot there, anyways. And I'm not too sure if I press shift, like crouch like this, will it increase my accuracy? I just know that jumping and running is a bad way to aim in this game. You will literally lose accuracy for days. And it's not recommended to do that. So if you play that game, take note of that. Um, this map, um, from what I know, from Counter-Strike um, Glow Offensive is more CT-sided than it is T-sided. And what that basically means is that this map is easier for the counter-terrorists, or in that case, the SWAT team, um, because it has so many visible standpoints where you can guard um, easy spots for to prevent the terrorists coming in. Now, I could be wrong, it could be the opposite, 
Um, but from uh, my experience, it's always this map is more CT sided than it is T sided. So yeah, that's that's one thing I note. Another thing though, a huge difference between this and the competitive version of Counter Strike Global Offensive is you do not switch sides. You ha stay on this side, and it's a best of I think eight rounds wins. So whoever gets to eight rounds rounds first wins the game. So it's it's a really uh, it's a really action game packed game and it all depends on like whether you win rounds or not winning rounds is huge not by the fact that you just only win but the fact is you get more money and the more money you get the more you can spend better weapons with now um, if you're losing rounds don't buy a gun every round um, because you'll buy bad guns and you won't be able to defend yourself all right so we'll go here this is kind of a little risky because there's always usually someone watching this area um yep right there there we go, got him a headshot. I think that's one shot right there. And I think he was using this, an AUG. Okay, I wouldn't recommend the AUG, and even though it's a good gun to zoom in and increase your accuracy, I would prefer this almost any day just because it's a little bit stronger and you always get those one shot headshots. It, it feels a lot stronger in my opinion. I, I haven't really played, a lot of people have been telling me though that this, um, whatchamacallit, that the scoped guns are a lot better than in Counter Strike Global Offensive, but I don't seem to think that's the case. Now, what is this? Okay, coins. We can collect coins around here. Okay, so that's another thing I guess that they did in this here is incorporate like their like mindplex currency in here and just add coins. Okay, so I gotta see where everyone else is. Okay, so everyone's here. So it's on the ground. Oh, no, that's not the gun I want. And we're gonna go here and get this all up and ready and we're gonna buy a better gun let's try the desert eagle now if you ever buy the desert eagle do not shoot this thing like a quick rapid fire gun this thing um you kind of have to shoot it in such a way that you shoot once let it um let let go of it for a little bit like as in like don't take like quick shot rapid session shots and then shoot again because it has a huge recoil and what that basically means is that oh shoot i'm whoops I just pressed the wrong thing there. I just pressed the Optivine zoom. and But anyways, the uh, Desert Eagle isn't a gun you shoot rapidly. Because if you do, then you're going to, um, you're not going to get your shots on point. Um, and I just dropped the bomb. I just did a game-breaking play there. I didn't even realize I had the bomb. And, but having the bomb is kind of important too. Because you're going to be the person that controls the game almost for the terror side. Because you could either... A, plant the bomb, or B, run around like a lunatic like I just did right there, and drop the bomb and potentially lose the round, which I think is going to happen. Hopefully not, though. Hopefully our last two guys are really, really good. Maybe they're top to class, and we'll get the other guys. I hope that's the case, because that would be great. Um, let's see from the looks of it. Where is our guys? Um, oh, let's go here. Oh, yep, they're right there. Uh, let's see. And is the bomb here? No, bomb. Bomb is still at B. Be careful. Careful. And they're guarding B like it's nobody's business. Oh, he's got the bomb. And he's gonna plant it. Oh, he didn't plant it. Too nice try, though. He, we almost came back. He killed three people. And... Well, there's only it was a five v two. I got three thousand two hundred fifty dollars, so that means I'm gonna buy some armor, a helmet, and that. Now, in Counter Strike Global Offensive, you cannot buy a helmet. You have to buy Kevlar first, and then you can buy a helmet. And in this case, it seems to be it doesn't matter. So that's a di a huge difference, and it can potentially change up the strategy. All right, I'm gonna toss one of those flash grenades. Um, I believe in fight myself. Okay, I'm walking a little bit slower. Whoa, okay. Yeah, I didn't even realize there was a person there. I think I flashed myself. That was a mistake and a half if I say so myself. But they're all watching it kind of like how you would an actual counter strike. They're, they're smoking um, B, which is something you should do immediately if you're on this side. You've been to the counter to I mean, the terrorist inventory. And they've got B pretty down put. I think they might win this round. If we go over here, all the way to the other side, 
I think, okay, so no one's here. We should have went for A, actually, to be honest, because that's a great place to go. And what the heck is this? Okay, that I've never seen that before, but um, that's a pumpkin just in the middle of nowhere. But you should always want to stay in a group when you're playing this game. It's very hard to, in terms of communication. Oh, this guy might take in the get in the bag. This guy's fighting him 1v1, 1v1. Hopefully no 2v2. Oh, he's got him. He's got him down put. This, where's the last guy? Um, hopefully he gets the last guy. I don't know where he is. But he's got to, if he gets this, he's clutched the game. All right, he's going to plant the bomb now. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, shoot. Oh, man, he got, oh, he could have gotten that if he just, oh, he was so close. Every time. All right, I'm going to buy the CZ75 auto. It's a really good gun up close. Um, it's a good save gun, in my opinion, because you don't, it doesn't really uh, cost much, and you can get some good kills with it. Downside is, though, it does not have a lot of ammo. You can run out of this puppy in almost two clips. Actually, that's what happens. You reload it. Once you run out of it once and reload, it's gone, and it's basically you're going to be fending off with your knife. Which I have to say, the knife is actually pretty good in this game. Um, it wasn't bad in the actual CS GO, but it's a lot better because you can you can use it in a Minecraft type of style. Ooh, I guess if I can get this guy. Nope, nope, no, I didn't. Alright, I gotta wait for him to come over. Wait for him to come over. Hopefully he didn't see me. Hopefully he didn't see me. Uh, oh. Right, can I get this guy? Yes. Alright, okay, I gotta run away. Gotta run away. Gotta run away. Oh, shoot. I can't help my butt. I can't help my butt. Um, okay, so I'm gonna drop this. Drop this. No. Drop this. Okay, now I got the Galil. That's some... Oh, no, no, no. Can I get him? Yes, I got him. Holy man, holy macarons. Alright, um, uh, I don't know where my buds are, but I know. Alright, the bomb is dropped. Okay, so we should probably get the bomb. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, he's got scope. He's got scope. He's got scope. He's ready to use it. He's ready to roll it. Use it. Alright. Um, uh, I don't know what to do at this point. Uh, let's see. This guy. Alright, got some hits on him. Got some hits. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh no, 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 no. This guy has a scope. Gotta hide out, gotta hide out, reload. Uh, uh, e, uh, e, uh, e. Toss the, gr the grenade, and I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it with, despite having. Ooh, 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 hello, hello, hello. Oh man, where was this guy come from? He was. Oh, you little sneaky sna snuckers. I didn't even realize he was there. Ah, uh, they're catching up, guys. That's not good. Uh, I got, at least I got a few kills with just a basic gun. I'm gonna get back to my regular layout, though. And I'm not going to horse around. Um, not like how I did on my UHC. That was, oh man, I don't even know what happened on that UHC, to be honest. Um, if you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, well, yeah, I was playing UHC Season 10. It might be a spoiler to you, but I was using my horse and crashed into a wall and died. Not a good way to go. Not a good way to go. Um, so we're going to go here. We're going to... Chill with my bud, King Muppet, and we're gonna go. We're gonna go slay some guys. We're gonna sh shoot some good guys because we're the bad guys, and that's that's how it works. We're we getting shot from behind. I can't really tell. Um, let's just go up here and see what's happening. Um, looks like it's clear. All right, let's go, boys. Let's plant the bomb. Let's go plant the bomb. See, this is what happens when we stick together. We stick together like glue. We get become glue. Alright. Oh, he's planting the bomb. And. Alright, I'm gonna make sure. I'm gonna make sure that no one comes this way. If they do, I'll be tossing this guild grenade at them, and they would regret coming this way. Um, that's one thing I like about this game. You can press right click, and the grenade just explodes on impact. It just explodes. Like, there's. There's. Well, actually, no, no. Actually, that's wrong. I mean, as in, you don't have to. You don't have, like, a. Um, a time where it, it like you had to pull back the grenade. Oh, okay. We won that round. That's good. That's good. But you don't have like in global offensive. If you right click the grenade or left click the grenade, you have to open it, which takes some time. This one you just right click it and it goes and it just goes. And that's another thing to note. If you toss a grenade, it's it's actually on and shoot in this game. Um, it's both a right click feature. It's not a uh, left click feature as in most conventional shoot shooters because if you see left clicks actually to reload, or right clicks to shoot. 
All right, so we're gonna go here, go here, toss one of those bad boys, and keep shooting, and reload. I have no idea what's happening. I can't even see, but I think I think a guy got this. I don't even know to be honest. Um, hmm. Let's go here. Oh. I got some hits on him. That's good. That's good. That's good. Let's go up here. Let's go behind this wall, or it's called bench in the actual game. And hopefully our guy can plant the bomb. Bomb is with King Muppet, my bud. He's planting the bomb from the looks of it. Just got flashed. Can't see a single thing. Well, actually I can, but not too much. So I'm going to sit here like a little dummy. Some guy could be tacky. Oh god. That guy was over there. Um... Gonna shoot there because someone might be defusing. I doubt it, but hey, you might not know. Someone might pull fastball. Get that person with the AK and um, let's go over here. Say hello, hello. All right, I have no more ammo. Um, if one person still alive. Nope, he's gone. Um, we're gonna run away because that bomb may explode. Nah, it won't. It won't. I just kidding with you guys. And we're gonna get some stuff like this, and we're going to get a better gun. Let's go with that. There we go. So I hope you guys liked my um, latest episode of J Wong Edits. I actually took a little while to do that one, and surprisingly, a lot of the ones that a lot of you guys requested were very interesting. I never tried editing, like I don't think I ever have a human onto like an animal. And it was kind of an experience for me because it was like, I'm not really sure what I'm doing, but I, at the same time, I had a good idea of how to do it. And I think it came out pretty decent in my opinion. It could have been a little bit better, but it came out pretty decent. Oh, that guy's dead. And I think in the future, I was actually looking at some people that have done some examples like that, and I think in the future, what I'm going to do is not put like the entire face on, but like have it in such a way where you, um, put like the eyes on like the at part of the animal's eyes and you put the nose, the human nose on the part of the animal nose and so forth. Um, I was looking at some examples of Nicolas Cage on like rabbits or Nicolas Cage on cats because a lot of people like to edit Nicolas Cage onto animals and so um, th that's a good place to actually look for Photoshop examples and yeah a lot of people did some really good examples of Nicolas Cage on animals. Um, but yeah. Uh, I'm probably going to do more of those edits in the future, so if you want to check out my latest episode of Jay Wong Edits, um, you can check it out on my channel, it's in the playlist, or it's the episode before this, in the outro. It'll be the, in the outro for sure. Um, Alright, so we're going to go here, and I'm not sure if there's anyone here. Nope, it's clear. Oh, no, hello! You're done. You're still here. You're not here anymore. And he had a Desert Eagle. I wonder if he's going to try using that. Oh! He got me for a star AUG. Now, see, that's what the thing I'm wondering. Is the AUG actually really good in this game? I'm not even too sure myself, to be fairly honest. When it comes to using the AUG on any uh, game that I play on CSGO, it doesn't seem to work for me. It it kind of works in such a way that it, you can aim through it and that's cool and all, but it doesn't give you the kills easily, especially if someone's a skilled player you will probably die against them. They will just one-shot headshot you with an AK or or something else, or two-shot you with an M4A1 and you're dead. Um, I'd also, so the guns I'd recommend on here, there's three guns I'd recommend for main. Um, AK-47, the P90, um, and I think the other gun would be the, uh, what you call it, the AWP or AWP. Um, and no, no, we're not referring to the Minecraft um, Planet Op. We're referring, that's how you pronounce AWP in terms of CSGO lingo or Counter-Strike lingo. That's the case. Um, I actually was confused at first too, guys. I, when someone told me to grab the op, I was like, why would I grab the server op? Um, and it wasn't like, I wasn't even joking either. Like I actually asked that question and people were like, no, that's not what they meant, silly. It just means, um... It means the rifle. Um, there's two types of rifles. They both have two unique uh, pronunciations in this game. One of them being the Scout, which is the, I think, SG something, and the other one being the Op, which is 
the AWP. So yeah, those are the two, those are the two difference, two scoped uh, rifles that are sniper rifles. The scouts are really weak compared to the op. The ops usually are one hit kill, and the uh, SG is sometimes it's a one hit kill on headshot, but anywhere else it's not. So it's very it's very uh, hard to use at times. But the benefit is the scout usually is lighter than the op. Um, as well, I'm surprised they haven't added the automatic sniper for um, Mind Strike yet. That is a sign like always one of the most infamous guns on um, what you call it on CS:GO. But it's at the same time a gun I wouldn't recommend because a lot of times it's affiliated with people that are known to being noobs. Um, but at the same time, a lot of people still use it just because. Um, it's not a bad gun. It's not real. Well, actually, I wouldn't say it's a bad. It's an amazing gun, but that's the problem. It's way too good that it's almost that almost anyone can almost use it. It's oh, we just dropped the bomb. All right, gonna toss a flash. Person should now be blinded. Can't, oh, that range doesn't work on here. Like, oh god. All right, I'm gonna load my gun. Is there a person with op? <sighs> okay, so here's the thing. When I shoot with the AK-47, it seems to be an, a triple burst. Like, there's, I automatically have to shoot too. Right, we're, gonna, we're gonna rotate. I don't think we're actually gonna even be able to take that spot. Mostly because there's no point of going to B when they're all at B or at least guarding the middle. So let's just go to the other side of things and let's see if anyone's even here. If anyone's not here, this is gonna be great because then I will be able to get a free opportunity to plant the bomb. And yeah, planting the bomb's great. All right, so planting the bomb. Planting the bomb, hopefully no one's around me. No one's around me, good. And now hopefully we'll able to get this. I'm crossing my fingers that no one's around me. Put the bomb. Okay. Oh shoot. Okay, yeah, I got that person. All right, is this one v one? It's one v one. I'm not sure where this last guy is. I don't know where this last guy is. Uh, I hate one v ones. Um. Oh, he's tunnel. Okay, he's tunnel. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Yeah, I won us the game. That feels good. Oh my goodness, that was stressful, guys. But we won it. Eight five. They almost came back, but they didn't, and that's good. So, I hope you guys liked this video, and if you did, drop a like. If you want to stay for more content, make sure you subscribe. Just do whatever you want, guys. And, um, hope you guys liked this video, and as always, have a great day, please. And see you guys later. Yeah.